How's it going, everybody? I know, it's so weird to see me actually doing a vlog video for once in the first time in like, I don't know, three years, two years, something like that. So I know that this is a video that's a little bit different from my normal content. And this one's gonna be completely unscripted. This is just sort of a response to a comment that I got that really got my attention. It's something that I would absolutely love to do, but I don't know if it's actually feasible. It would be very difficult to do. I received a comment on my community poll asking me if it would be feasible for me to go and vlog and do a trip all around the, the United States and collect fossils in every state. Now that would absolutely be like, that That would be such an awesome bit of content that I could bring you guys. But there is a couple of issues that I might run into trying to do something like that. The main one being that basically every single state in the United States has specific laws having to do with collecting fossils on public land, especially if you're not going through a museum, which if I was, if I was gonna be going through a museum, that would require me to basically get on board with every with a museum in every state of the United States, which is kind of unfeasible. The way around that would be for me to basically get permission from a private landowner in every single state of the United States for me to go dig on their land. Unfortunately, that's just kind of one of the things that's very complicated, and it's probably why no other YouTuber has ever attempted to do something like this. Because it would be some awesome content, but the logistics of it is just, I, mm, I don't know. I don't know if, that, if that's actually doable. Who knows? I, I might try to slowly start expanding into that, and maybe, you know, as opportunities become available, maybe start to do that in little bits and pieces. That might be cool. That's actually one of the reasons why I moved back to Florida, because specifically Florida has a very lenient, open policy when it comes to fossil hunters who are not affiliated with the museum being able to hunt on private land. There's a process, you can get a, a fossil hunting permit in the state of Florida. And there are certain parameters that you have to adhere to to keep that permit up to date. Things like reporting your findings and whatnot and being willing to work with the Museum of Natural History in Gainesville to make your findings available to the science at large, which I think is a great policy. I wish more states did things like this. But the other part of it is that there is a little bit of an honor system where people who are only interested in collecting fossils for profit, which, you know, we've all heard the stories in the past couple of years about things like T-Rex skeletons selling for a couple tens of millions of dollars. But I love the thought. I love that idea. I just wish it was actually something that was a little bit more obtainable. And who knows? Who knows what, what that idea could morph into as I, you know, as I let it rattle around in my brain. And hey, if you enjoyed actually getting these little short little snippets of things as thoughts come to my mind, I wouldn't mind making little short videos like this just to give everybody a little bit more content. This isn't going to stop me from continuing things like my History of the Earth series. I understand everybody wants to see that more, but it's a lot of work. Those videos are a lot of work. But if you enjoyed this and you would like to see more little things like this along the way, just here and there, whenever thoughts come to mind, give this video a like comment below, give me some more ideas, because this is awesome stuff for me to consider. I'm trying to expand paleoanalysis out into new avenues. But anyway, I'm getting back to work on the history of the Earth Permian. Have a good one, everybody.